In this video, I will show you how to translate a small Word document using WordFast Anywhere. The document we want to translate is this one. It's in Finnish and we will translate it into English. For that, we will be able to use some sample terminology supplied in the form of an Excel sheet. It has two columns, one for Finnish terms and the other one for English terms. Since WordFast Anywhere is not able to import terminology directly from Excel, we will save this file as a tab delimited text file and for that I will select as the file type Unicode text. And finally, we have a reference translation memory available in the TMX format that we will be able to import into WordFast Anywhere. So let's switch to WordFast Anywhere. The address is freetm.com and as the name implies, it is uh, completely free. So I will log in to my account. And now I will choose the file I want to translate and I can drag and drop that file to this area of the browser window. Now my file has been added, I can open it. And next I will switch to TM and Glossaries and Setup. Here I will create a new TM. The source language will be Finnish Finland and the target language will be English United Kingdom. I will assign it the name Sunto and I will save it. Next, I will upload my TMX. I will assign it the name Reference since it's a reference TM and I will select it here. So it's this one. Open and upload. My TMX has been uploaded. Everything is valid. I can define it as uh, read only and I will define both TMs as active. Finally, I will upload my sample terminology. So the source language is again Finnish Finland. Target language is English United Kingdom. And the assigned name will be Sunto. I will select the file. It's this text file saved from Excel. And I will upload it. Now my six terms were imported, all valid. And I can set this glossary as active and I will save my settings. Now I can start translating. So I can use this button here, start next. It's also alt down like in other versions of WordFast, classic and pro. I can enter my translation and when I'm ready, I can use either the same button or again alt down. Now in the next segment, I have uh, one recognized term, so valico, although it is valicot in the source segment. The first word actually also belongs to the glossary, but was not recognized, so it was not similar enough. So I have to type it myself. And the second one, although it was recognized, but it was not highlighted in the source segment, which means I have no way to insert it automatically, so I also have to type it here. Now I press Alt down. Again, I have Pineke, which was recognized, although it occurs as Pineketta, different uh, inflected form. I will type my translation and move to the next segment. Here I have two recognized terms, Paina and Alotus Valico, that were highlighted in the source segment. So this means I will be able to use the auto-suggest feature to copy them to the target segment. So the first one is press 2. If I start typing P, I can insert the rest of the word. Now the rest of the translation and Alotus Valico, it's start menu. So again, S and enter to copy it. All down to move to the next segment. Here again, one recognized term, so press 2, the rest of my translation. And the last word was in the glossary, but was not recognized, so I have to enter it, menu. Next segment, all down. Here I have a 100% match, because segment number 6 is identical to segment number 4, which we already translated. So I can move to the next segment with all down. Here, one recognized term, so press 2 and the rest of my translation. And this word Taustavalo, I'm not sure about its meaning, so I will be using the concordance search feature of WordFast Anywhere to find out whether it occurs in the TM. So I'll move to TM and glossaries, and concordance search is this command here. So I need to highlight the word I'm interested in, Taustavalo, and press either this icon or Control-Alt-C like in WordFast Classic.
WordFast Anywhere finds uh, nine hits based on this search word. It was an exact search, but if I want to have more results, I can use advanced and add an asterisk at the end of the word. So it's the same syntax as in WordFast Classic or MemoQ, and now OK. And now instead of nine hits, I have 15, and I have such compound words as taustavalo asetustao, taustavalo tila, so a little bit more results. So I can see from these results that the translation I'm interested in is backlight, so I can highlight. There is no specific command like in WordFast Classic or WordFast Pro to copy this uh, selected word to the end of the target segment, so I will use Ctrl C. I can close this window that I no longer need, and here in the target segment, Ctrl V, I can paste it. Now, if I want to add this term pair to my glossary, I can select the source term, select the target term, and press Ctrl Alt T, like in WordFast Classic, and now I can press Save. And from now on, Taustavalo will be recognized when it occurs in a segment to be translated. I can move to the next segment with all down. Here I have a fuzzy match, 61% fuzzy match that came from the TM. It came from segment number 5 that we previously translated. So I can see the changes are highlighted in yellow. Previously we had uh, Surenta Accessi which is increase. Now we had Pienenta Accessi which is decrease. So I need to make this change here. And previously we had Ulospan which was up. Now we have Alaspan which is down. So I need to make this change and I'm ready. So I'll move to the next segment, or down. The last segment contains tags, and tags were introduced because of formatting. We had a portion of text in italic. So what I will do, I will first enter my translation. So keep press 2 and the rest of my translation. And now I can insert the tags to the places where they belong to. So the first one is at the beginning of the segment. To select a tag, I can use the next placeable command which is Ctrl Alt Right. This will select the tag and the copy placeable command Ctrl Alt Down will insert it into the target segment. Now I can move to the next place and again I can press Ctrl Alt Right until my tag is selected and Ctrl Alt Down to insert it. Now the third one it comes here, so Ctrl Alt Right right, right, and now down, and the last one, control alt right, and control alt down. Now I'll press alt down, and what fast anywhere tells me I have reached the end of the translation, and it also gives me instructions on what to do next, so to use the file tab and select download. So this is what I will do now, I will use file, download, uh, I will download the translated document, now I have several possibilities, so either I can download the file to my local drive, this is what I will do, but if I were using a computer in an internet cafe, for instance, I could have it uploaded to my Google Drive account or to my Dropbox account. The document will be saved in the same folder as my source document, and if I open it, I can see everything is just fine, including formatting and the picture. So there you have it, how to translate a document in WordFast Anywhere. Thank you for watching. Do subscribe to my channel for more similar content aimed at translators. Also hit the like button if you found this video useful. Use comments below this video if you have any questions or feedback. And see you in the next one.